what's up? I have uh, game one between Liquid Red and Bijou. Ah, uh, these are from the them thing. Let's see if I can remember. Um, TSL4 qualifiers, which is pretty goddamn cool. So, obviously we've got Liquid Red down the bottom and Bishu up the top. The map is in fact GSL Daybreak. Uh, I believe I already said that it's game one, but if I didn't, I just did that. So there you go. Okay, cool. So, I'm super keen because I didn't get to see like hardly any of the qualifiers because here in Australia it was stupid o'clock in the morning when they were going on and I fell asleep halfway through, halfway through which was devastating for me and once again it is uh, stupid stupid o'clock in the morning so it kind of sucks but whatever right. so relatively standard builds from both players except I haven't actually seen any of Bishu's play before. Um, I saw one game and that was recently. But, so yeah, so I'm not sure if he normally puts these here. Maybe he does, maybe he doesn't, I don't know. Either way, it's a relatively good wall off, especially if he gets something off here. Um, but I'm not sure it'll, if it'll make much of a difference considering Rhett's going for an early expansion. At uh, the two minute mark. Um, also, by stupid o'clock in the morning, it's currently five past uh, three. I was going to say six. It's definitely not six. Right. That would be a stupid o'clock. Right. Has he got into the base yet? A little bit. So there's the uh, spawning clock on game. Which, I only just realised, it's basically the whole Zerg gene pool right here. Which everyone probably knows. I mean I knew what it did, obviously. I'm not retarded, but I only just made the connection. Oh it's a gene pool. So yeah. So both players know that uh that may be a little bit loud, hang uh bit more. I'm gonna love that just for lols. Cool. That better be better. That better be better. Alright. Looking at x splitters should be fine. Uh, so this probe's still here. It's just chilling like a boss. Um. Here's the other down. So I've been this course going down. Whoa, I had to lag here for a second. Second, the simulator is just finishing. Uh, Red still doesn't have a second extractor. All right, we're going for some roaches. Sweet. So that's morphing. Wait, no, it's not. What am I saying? I'm a retard. Okay. Uh, stalkers be good. Assume we were. Yep. Warp gate research like a bow. Let me just speed that up because that was ridiculously slow. And by ridiculously slow, I mean it was on faster. As well as the faster times too, which is what I normally cast on. Um. Yeah. Cool. So still relatively uh, standard play by both players. Uh, we may... No, okay. I think there's a probe there. Which may be putting down a forward pylon! But it wasn't a probe, so it's okay. Right, so there's the probe there. Getting a pylon over there. Nice and out of the way. That small force of one zealot and one stalker does fall. Uh... Okay, another pile on there. Now the question is, will it be time to counter this? Which I don't think it will. Although these 
probes do take care of the uh, speedlings quite well. Bishu GG's and leaves the game with actually a third one here. Which is pretty lolzy. Right, that'd be annoying. Play this one down there. I don't get to use it. Right, sweet. So make sure you subscribe. I'll put an annotation over the uh, the heating games logo right here, where my mouse is going behind. So you can just click that, it'll take you to a subscribe screen to my channel, you can subscribe like a boss, and I'll see you in my next video.